Today we will see the reaction of different vehicles during hitting speed bumps at high speed, using Adam's car software. Subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for the latest update. Today we will see different models hitting the speed bump. And while hitting we see the different reaction that vehicle is gaining during running at top speed. The model that we are gonna see today are sedan, convertible, subcompact, pickup truck, sports car, Baja, and Se vehicle. These really hammer your car's suspension if you hit them too fast. Your car's body doesn't have time to get up once you hit them fast, so you'll drag rock bottom of your car on the hindrance, if you have a car with limited ground clearance. Your suspension can take a beating as well, traveling to its limits and really bouncing everyone in the car. Speed bumps can damage your car if you hit them too fast. The suspension isn't normally made to regulate to sharp fast big bumps, and people bumps can make the shocks bottom or top out, potentially causing damage to them. Too low a vehicle hitting too high a hindrance can damage parts on rock bottom of your car. What happens when you perform this kind of stunts? Hitting bumps faster causes the suspension to compress excessively to soak up the bump. Even if you don't bottom out the suspension, you are still placing extra wear and fatigue upon the springs, dampers, and all associated bushings. Hitting speed bumps at that speed won't cause any immediately obvious damage, but it'll cause accelerated wear and fatigue on your suspension. You'll only know about it when a damper fails and leaks oil or spring brakes. This kind of simulation helps you to understand your vehicle performance during various circumstances. In the next video, we're gonna see the different types of full vehicle simulations, and how to import external CAD files and perform simulations on them. What types of full vehicle analysis we can perform in Adam's car? They are as follows. Open loop steering events. Cornering events. Straight line events. Course events. Durability events. Roll stability events. Suspension parameter measurement machine test. One important question generally asked which is the weakest component in the suspension system? Answer in the comments section below. Like, share, subscribe to our channel to motivate us for this kind of tutorials. And to follow us on various platform links have been provided in the description below.